The deceived creator Lisa McGee has confirmed the series finale will wrap up the mystery, answering viewers' questions. Airing on Channel 5, the psychological drama follows English student Ophelia, as she embarks on an illicit affair with her married professor Michael Callahan. When Mr. Callahan suddenly disappears, Ophelia tracks him down in Donegal, Ireland, only to discover his wife has died in a mysterious house fire. After Michael's intentions were drawn into question on last night's episode, fans were left wondering whether the professor was responsible for his wife's untimely death. Thankfully, ahead of the series launch on Monday, creators Lisa and Tobias Beer confirmed the series will not end on a cliffhanger. Read more related articles Read more related articles Lisa, who's also the genius writer behind Derry Girl, says, this story does conclude. That's one of my frustrations sometimes with those songs that leave you on a hook at the end of a series, not answering drives me mad as a viewer. We really didn't want to do that to people, we wanted to go hear what happened and answer it fully. Read more related articles Read more related articles Luckily, Lisa also hinted a second series could be on the cards, adding they could probably write another thrilling installment. Coming up with ideas for season 2, Tobias remarked, we might have to do it slightly differently whereas perhaps not bringing back all the characters, but using the house. Telling a different story using the house perhaps. The supernatural element to the series is deliberate, as Ophelia witnesses the ghost of Michael's late wife appearing outside the ramshackle house in Donegal. Lisa based the storyline on the myth and lore of Irish ghost stories, calling on the haunting tales passed down through generations and blending it with the illicit romance in the scene. Reflecting on their inspiration, Tobias explained, Lisa always says she believes in ghosts but she's not frightened of them, cause it's not a big deal. But I don't believe in them, but in terrified cause if I saw one my whole world would change. He added, there's an ease, in Ireland. In talking about the supernatural and the mystical, it's very much a run-of-the-mill thing, not a big deal to talk about. That was quite unusual for me. The Deceived continues tonight at 9pm on Channel 5.